I was at the Walgreens going to pick up a prescription for my mother. There were three women behind the counter. I, I heard this loud like, BAM! And the next thing I know I hear somebody say, this is a stick up. And at first I thought, huh? And so I kind of leaned back to, to look on the other side of the partition just in time to see one male who had just jumped onto the ground level. Another male was actually on the counter in the squatting position getting ready to jump over and he had a mask covering up half of his face. So I reach in my purse, I grab my gun, simultaneously I'm jumping over the counter. Oh my God, um, Walgreens Pharmacy in Green Valley Ranch. From Tower Road, the pharmacy is being robbed. How long ago did this happen? This is happening right now, it's happening right now. Oh my God. I consciously made the decision to engage. The reason I did that was because you've got three innocent women, potential victims behind that counter. So as I have these two men at gunpoint, I'm yelling at them, get your hands in the air, get your hands in the air now. Do what I say, I swear I'll shoot you. As they're on their knees, that's when I yell out, off-duty cop needs help, off-duty cop needs help, someone call 911. December 911, what is the address of your emergency? I'm witnessing a robbery of a pharmacy at Walgreens. The only thing between them and freedom is me. Because I was close, he was able in one swift moment to jump up and he swings and he hits me. There's a struggle between he and I and I pull the trigger. They're shooting, they're shooting. The bullet went past his head and embedded itself in the overhang above him. So I fire my weapon again. This time, unfortunately, I hear a click, and it was as loud as day. And I knew at that moment my gun had malfunctioned. The younger guy jumps over the counter, he runs. The older guy then attempts to jump over the counter. I grab his legs and I'm struggling to pull him back over because I'll be god darn if they're not going to get arrested. He then jumps over the counter and runs. And I chose to pursue. Just a citizen pulls up to park to go into Walgreens. I demand their cell phone. I explain it's an emergency. I'm a cop. I need your phone. She's running after him right now. And he, she said she's with the Denver police. Yeah, she said free Denver police. He was ultimately taken into custody about 3 o'clock in the morning. The younger guy was actually apprehended within moments of the incident. And if I had to do it all over again, I wouldn't do it any different. You prepare yourself on the job, but you, you don't go day to day thinking that something like this is going to happen, let alone off duty. And you just hope at that moment that your training is going to kick in, and it kicked in. The girls are okay. Two suspects that are wanted in other metro area robberies are taken into custody. And I'm okay, so I think everything ended, ended well. My mom, bless her heart, she's like, I am so sorry I sent you to pick up my prescription. I said, Mom, I said, you know, I could have made a left into King Supers or a, wide into, a right into Walgreens, and I chose the easier route, so I thought.